Good morning. So, summer break right around the corner. Kids are going to be looking for fun stuff to do, and today we're talking about fun family activities that won't break the bank, most importantly. So, joining me, we have our entertainment trends expert, Abby Reyes, to talk about streaming week. Hey, Abby, how are you? Hi, Randy. I'm great. How are you? Awesome. I'm good. Thank you. So, for those of us who have never heard of this before, what is streaming week? <laughs> Um, streaming week is happening right now until May 20th, and it's really a time to celebrate your favorite pastime, or at least my favorite pastime, watching television. Um, we are giving you access to a ton of great free entertainment, entertainment, free TV, top shows, full seasons, sh uh, movies, the whole shebang. So definitely take advantage if you have a Roku streaming device um, of all of the great content that's available to you. Awesome. So you say that there are three ways streaming can actually save us money. So you have to spill those details. Yes, I'm happy to do so. I mean, summertime is notoriously an expensive season with all of the vacations, summer camp, and whatnot, and streaming actually gives you a little bit of flexibility. So I know that a ton of people may have multiple cable boxes in the home, so one great way to save money is to actually get rid of all but one cable box and add streaming devices to the rest of the rooms. And that way, um, you won't have to compromise on primetime shows or local news. You can still watch your favorite TV shows um, and channels and have it all in one place. But again, not have to pay those multiple rental fees. Um, another great tip to save money this summer is to actually take your Roku device with you when you go on vacation. It, For me personally, it's my favorite travel companion. I bring my Roku streaming stick with me in my purse and literally when I get to the hotel or um, an Airbnb that I'm staying at with my family, I can plug the device in, put on my fuzzy slippers and pick up right where I left off. So it's a really great way, to, again, to have entertainment at your fingertips but not break the bank. And then um, one, another great way is to consider a staycation. Vacations can be expensive, and instead of splurging on that expensive give, um, getaway, um, you may want to take a staycation and, and, and with your streaming device and really get your family together to spend quality time with one another watching your favorite shows and not necessarily spend a lot of money. So there's Absolutely. three great ways this summer to, to Absolutely. Save. I made the switch from uh, Comcast to Roku just this year. It's been great. Do you have any <laughs> suggestions on what people should watch? Are there any shows trending right now? Oh my gosh, there's so many amazing things to watch. And again, Streaming Week, we've kind of handpicked a selection of amazing content for you. We're unlocking tons of great things like HBO's first season of Big Little Lies. I know season two is coming up, so I'm definitely gonna, ca gonna catch up during Streaming Week. Um, if you are a Property Brothers fan, we have the full series available to you during Streaming Week, or you want some dramas like New Amsterdam. Again, we have so much available during Streaming Week. Um, you should really, really take advantage of it. And last question, where can people go for more information? So for more information, visit Roku.com. Awesome. Short and simple. Thank you so much, Abby. Thank you, Randy.